I want to take you into the Citrus Invention Lab. This was one of the very first maker spaces in the whole UC system, and it started in 2012, and it's one of my favorite places to go and be inspired. You come in and students access the lab through a maker pass system. This is like a library card for making, and it lets you access the facilities and the tools and the expertise. Oh, here's Chris Myers. Uh, he's the senior lab manager of the Citrus Invention Lab. Maybe he'll give us a tour. Yes, come on in. Um, <laughs> welcome. This is the Citrus Invention Lab. We are one of the first maker spaces on campus, and I, I think the best. Um, and, uh, we, have a, we have all these digital fabrication and hand tools to, for everyone's needs, student, faculty, staff, everyone, we welcome. Uh, this is our 3D printer rack, where you can just come in and grab your filament, load it up, and go. We don't even charge for the filament. And speaking of going, here we have our GoFab machines where you, you can actually check out a 3D printer. You can grab it, check it out, and go print wherever you want safely. Um, further, further on, we have more 3D printers. This is an ABS printer for all your ABS needs. Um, further on back, we have uh, some SL, SLA machines, uh, uh, laser-based uh, resin uh, uh, printers. We can do really high resolution and pretty quickly too. So if you need to do a uh, 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 superhero chess set, you, you have it made here. Chris, who are, who are these people up here? Those are a bunch of characters. <laughs> uh, now this is our student staff, our super user staff. And this is a group of students who are highly trained and motivated. They keep this lab going after hours and on weekends. So it's a very, we can offer a lot of uh, different hours uh, and fit the students' uh, need, uh, which is great. Uh, we have our first aid here, which is uh, band-aids for all your needs because we have all these amazing uh, hand tools. So uh, you, uh, you could actually grab something off the printer or laser cutter and then continue uh, modifying it to, to uh, work. Come on back here. We have some great, uh, great area to get messy. Uh, we have a um, uh, vinyl cutter here for all your laptop sticker needs. This is very popular. It's very busy in the beginning of the semester usually. Uh, back here we have a casting area for um, silicone molds and soft tooling. Uh, you know, casting in um, other flexible materials or urethanes or vacuum tanks, uh, pressure vessels. Um, to get very high quality casted parts from. We have a vacuum form, a pretty nice automatic vacuum form machine, pretty automated uh, for a lot of um, thermal forming and things uh, of that nature. Over here we have our laser cutter stations. We have two uh, pretty good uh, laser cutters. They get a lot of use and uh, uh, fulfill a lot of uh, needs. We have, um, back here we have uh, circuit board mills. We have LPKF. Which does the you know, basically industry standard type of uh, double layered boards. Uh, and uh, we have a other mill for uh, simpler things. And uh, we like to think that you can come in here and breadboard and then CAD up your design and, and uh, mill out your circuits and walk away uh, with a completed. Oh, look here. Here's a student returning a uh, <laughs> GoFab printer. <laughs> hey, student. So, hey, printer. Um, we have a reflow oven and microscopes. You can do SMD work. Um, uh, some really nice soldering stations uh, uh, where you can actually you know, you know, solder everything together. Scopes, power supplies, all this electronic equipment. Um, uh, this is a, a pretty well outfitted um, uh, electrical bench area. Um, moving on. We have um, a lot of cool projects going on. This is a really neat little um, robot that um, uses camera AI. It's going to be uh, for a, um, a art and technology project for a museum exhibition. This is just a scale prototype to prototype the electronics and the pro uh, programming. And the real one's going to be giant and, um, and uh, yeah, really cool. We have a whiteboard, projector, everything. We do a classes in here, a lot of workshops in here, a lot of um, school groups, uh, teams uh, meet in here, like Femtech, uh, Girls in Engineering, Enable Tech, um, the Rocket Club, um, and the, a lot of different groups, engineering groups and non-engineering groups come in here and use our space. 
This has been great. I love visiting the Invention Lab. It's one of my favorite places on campus. Uh, it's full of uh, not only exciting materials and tools, but people. Uh, Chris himself is a little modest. He comes from a background in Art Center College of Design. He also did a lot with toy design. He teaches uh, many of the design innovation courses. Um, I always come in here to be inspired by what's just happening. I say, come for the laser cutter, stay for the community. It's a really great place to uh, really sit yourself down and get your hands dirty and really explore some really cool materials. I know it's going to pick up and get really busy in here, uh, so we're going to move on. I think I'll take one of these GoFabs to go um, on my own adventure. So thanks, Chris. Thanks for stopping by.